Hey, hey, hey guys, this is Hawkeye and I am back with the Hunter. Yes, I know it's been quite a while. I have unfortunately had let my subscription lapse because I've been doing so much stuff with the fishing games and the uh, Halloween games and just in general haven't been as much interested in hunting by myself because Dulacaba has been very, very busy with Russian Fishing 4, so... I decided that I need to just come out here and do a little hunting myself and I came to Hammondal to see if I could find the Eurasian lynx because that is the newest animal that's been added to the game and so I'm gonna be going solo on this one guys so we don't have the wise expertise of Kachi Dulakaba and that's gonna probably be a major hindrance but we will see what we can do by ourselves this time Anyway guys, let me go ahead and let you know what I have got here. If I remember correctly, oh heck, what's it called? <laughs> it's called the 16 gauge 3.3 by 74R drilling combination gun. This gun, you can harvest any animal in the game. It is awesome. So it uses a number of different types of well, it uses regular rifle bullets and then it uses shotgun bullets. So you can switch them out and go for birds, you can go for coyote, you can go for anything. And all you have to do to switch it is hit the mouse number three button and it will switch between barrels. See? Just like that. Anyway, guys, we are going to go ahead and... Oh, I also forgot I've got my old trusty 10 point And my 454, in case there's a close encounter. So we are going to go out there and see what we can find. Alright, let's go ahead and do it. Alright, guys, we are loaded up. We have moose here, we have bear, we have reindeer number of different species here which is kind of good and I've got my moose collar got my moose juice looks like number six is empty here let's see uh, what kind of oh, I'll go ahead and put the no I've already got that there let's see uh, what else could I put in there I don't really well I guess I could Let's put the reindeer collar in there. That'll work. Okay. But we are going to go ahead and descent ourselves. Check the map here. I think what we're going to do is we're going to head. Uh, I think we're going to head this way. So we're going to just kind of follow along here might actually before we do that we might go down to here to this lake see if there's anything there and then may I yeah, I've changed my mind I'm gonna go there first walk around to this lake walk around to this lake and then come up here to this point of interest I think that's what we're gonna do so this is our next area so Let's go ahead and get this thing on the road here. Let's get our... So we're going to head towards the lake, which means we got to go up this. Because yeah, a lot of times things come down to the lakes and... What is this? A Norse pot. 1,044 years. That's cool. This looks like almost like a path. I don't think it is one though. Now we do have to be careful because there are brown bears here. And they get pretty big. I just heard a bear and I don't know where he is but I heard him and 
I'm afraid I'm going to get charged. Oh boy. Not good, people. Not good. Well, he didn't come out. I just heard him raise in hell, but... There we go. There's our male moose. But first I want to go over here because I think I see that bear's track and he was a hell of a lot closer than I thought he was. Not absolutely 100% certain why he didn't attack me. Just glad he didn't. No? That's the cow. Hmm. There we go. Straight ahead, guys. Our first moose. All right, we're... Let me check my camouflage here. Yeah, we're good camouflage-wise right here. Once we get past this, we're probably not going to be. So what I'm going to do is set up and give a call here. Squirt a little, well, dang on it, moose juice here. Where is the moose juice? He should come along. Let me get back behind this tree, though. <coughs> this side of it would be better. I think I'm going to use my crossbow. Alright, let's see. Yep. I can still see perfectly fine if I go prone as well, so that's good. Ah! There you are, my friend. There he is, guys. Strolling right on in. Let me see what the heck distance-wise he is. He's about... 28 meters. Right in the pocket. I don't think he's going to go far. He's moving. see him anymore but that was the last place I saw him let's let him get his run out let's just walk on with him slowly because he may still be up and moving but that looks like a pretty good clean shot what do we got here really I was sure that was a all right, guys, I see something over there. I don't know if that's him. Yes, it is. All right. 
We're not going to mess around here this time. That got it. That's it. He's down. Yeah, I think he was in a lot of pain anyway. He didn't look like he was too healthy. Well, that's a nice looking moose. All right, let's see here. Well, the first one was in the body, stomach, intestine, and the second one body, shoulder blade, right lung, neck bone 3, so it broke his neck basically. 154.913, not too bad. Not too bad at all. I'll go ahead and get a trophy shot of him. I wish the sun would come out because then I'd get a better shot. Those are some big antlers though. You'd think he'd have scored higher than that. Yeah, see how wide they are? And the tines are very long. No, I don't want a taxidermium. Well, maybe I will. I might put him in the other one. I've got that way. I'll have a moose, a moose head in both of them. All right. Well, where are we on the map? Cause he, we followed him all around to here. I had a feeling this would be a good spot. So I think I'm still going to keep heading this way maybe go over here and then down to here yeah sounds good to me I have a good feeling that finding a lynx is going to be really 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 hard because they are a very skittish creature But all we can do is try. I'm also not sure where off to find them. I know to find the bobcats in the big fields, but a lynx is a completely different species, so... And they look a lot alike, but their behavior is probably totally different. So, Alright guys, I had just started hearing a strange sound, and I believe it's a willow ptarmigan. The funny thing is, my thing is not registering his call. I just hear him making the call. Yep. There's a whole bunch of tracks. Wait a minute, there he is. I'll be damned. I think I'm just going to have to get him with this crossbow I got him scared off his buddy too uh, it looks like it's a male 556 not sure what that means <laughs> but we're gonna go ahead and move me a lot closer but this guy up here was well, let's see here hold on let's grab him by the head Alright, that's not bad. I don't have one for my lodge, so yes, I am going to taxiderming him. It sounds like there's another one. Hold on, let me see if I can't see him first. He sounds close. Yeah, the calls don't come up on the... 
calls don't come up on the hunter mate. Just makes things a little more difficult. <laughs> Alright, I guess they gave me the slip, guys. Alright, we found our first Eurasian Lynx track. I'm going to show you where it is on the map because that's probably going to be important. Looks like it's right here, the northernmost reach. Looks like he was at that rock. Probably urinated on it. Oh, I need to crouch. Yeah, this looks like a kind of a metal. Looks like he was roaming over this way. I wish I knew how long ago he was here. Let's toggle Eurasia Eurasian Lynx lore. Uh, it's not optional. Ah, oh, you got to kid me. I have to get the USB add-on for this. Oh, that sucks. Well, I don't think I'm going to be getting a Eurasian Lynx without some way of calling them. I am, however, going to go ahead and call that moose in. <laughs> he didn't seem too far out. I think what we'll do is we'll come over here. Let me check my camouflage here. Okay, I'm good. I'm good. Well, we'll go ahead and give him another call. Let's just get out of the way of that track. Yeah, the only way that I could get the Eurasian Lynx now is to track them and hope I can get close enough to him. That's not that easy to do. And I'm pretty sure I don't have a jackrabbit call. Nope. Didn't think I needed it. Okay. Gone it. I hear something, and it is big. He's not got the biggest horns, but... And he's down. Yeah, he's got those bullwinkle e horns. <laughs> yeah, see, he's only a 109. Left lung, shoulder blade, heart, right lung. Perfect shot, guys. He didn't feel a thing. Didn't feel a thing. Death was instantaneous. There we go. We'll accept. No, we won't. Ac yeah, we'll accept the trophy shot. We're not going to taxidermy. Oh wow! I heard that. This way, huh? Let's. 
the hell is that? We've got a lynx over here, and we've got what I think are reindeer over that way. So things just got really interesting, guys. I'm not really sure how close I'm going to get to this lynx, but we're going to give a shot. He is right in the direction of those tracks, though. Alright, I just found lynx poop. <laughs> the only problem is he is awfully close to this border. I don't like when they get close to the border because we can't go beyond it and they can and have done so. But yeah, fleeing. He heard something. He probably what? heard me. Alright, his latest trick said fleeing. And that's probably because he heard me. How the heck do I avoid that? Maybe I can't. Uh, without that collar, I can't. There's no way to call him in. That's really the only way I think you can really do it. I'm just being a human, making too damn much noise. And they can hear really well. All right, guys, we finally heard a reindeer off to the west. And it was a male. It had a deep call. It wasn't just an antler sound. So we're going to head that direction. Because usually if there's one, there's many. I think I'm going to go ahead and make a call here. Oh, I forgot. I move the reindeer collar out. Darn thing's not doing me any good. There he is again. He heard me. I don't see him on the map, though. Alright, guys. He is right over there. But he's behind those trees and that rock. And for what I could see of him, briefly... He's a nice one. Let's go prone here because I don't want him to see me at all. Now you can see him. What the hell? I can't see him now. Oh, there we go. Where'd he go? He was just there. Let's try it again. Holy crap, there he is. He changed directions on me. Come out here where I can actually see you, though. And he's down. Sounds like there was more than one. Yep, there's a whole bunch of them. Let me take a look here, see how many there are. I uh, can't tell, but I did get a nice one here.
As soon as I figure out where he is. <laughs> There he is. Damn. That's a big fella. He's in a really bad spot though. Left lung 620. I don't know what that is for reindeer. But we're going to try a trophy shot. I don't know if that's going to work here because he's, like I said, in a very bad spot. Ooh, he's heavy. Look at the size of those antlers. Let's see if I can't turn him around a little bit. <coughs> then try to bring me in. Might have to... Oh boy, this is one of those weird shots. accept that I'll taxidermy him because I he might have beaten the one that I'd already had all right guys I think I did a pretty good job of this particular hunt all by my lonesome unfortunately I couldn't find that lynx all right guys I have got all my new trophies in their new locations and did a little bit of rearranging here and I'll go ahead and show you those real quick here guys here's the ptarmigan I just got I like that pose it looks really good but he ended up being a 556 I don't know what that is honestly and well there's that turkey I got that one time and let's see here I actually had a bigger bobcat than I thought I had, 8.915. But yeah, this guy is big. He is a big one. He was 200 more points than the other one. The other one was like that I had on here was like 420, and this is this guy's 620. And I also went ahead and took off that white-tailed deer up here and put the Sitka deer I have up there. I don't think he scores very high, but at least looks better. Now we got a nice mixture of all the species. Whitetail, Sitka, Bison, Mule, um, Bartang, I think it is, and Reindeer, of course. But yeah, this is really looking nice. Still got a lot of birds to get. I just don't go after the birds as much. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed that episode. Please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe. And always remember, guys, aim straight, cast far, and have fun. And I will see you later. Bye-bye.